Yes guys, welcome back to the channel and today is a very exciting day because I'm heading to go and check out a new bike. It's new bike day and that is always a fun day. It's like Christmas. So you see, I love riding my gravel bike for adventures, but sometimes I just find the compromise of it just not being quite as comfortable enough or it's just the tires are too small to get over certain things and it just becomes a bit sketchy just a little bit annoying sometimes especially when it's an off-road adventure now you see if you want to go far on a bike the key is comfort and while off-road and on the gravel bike it just doesn't always feel that comfortable over a long period of time i've just done the downs way and as much as that bike was fine for it if i wanted to do a more longer distance each day i need something a bit more comfortable and that's where this bike comes in let's go check it out that's right the new bike is a bomb track beyond plus adv it's a slightly older model it's a 2019 model but this bike means I can go on some really fun adventures. Really, where the gravel bike just does not cut it, this bike is going to be the bike that I'm going to be using. So let's have a quick look at it. So let's go and have a little look at this bike. This is, I'm super excited about this bike because I can literally just roll it over anything. Um, so let's go and have a look at it. So like I said, it's the Bomb Track Beyond Plus ADV, which means it's got the carbon fork. It is a slightly older model, but they haven't really changed too much apart from a few more um, mounts really on the newer ones. So we've got the carbon fork, we've got the steel frame. Um, this is an extra large because I'm extra large. The whole drivetrain is GX SRAM GX Eagle um, with 1150, I think, on the back. Um, and the brakes are SRAM guides and everything is stock in terms of the bars, seat posts and everything. I might change the um, saddle, but I was just testing out the Jones bars um, and they do obviously have a really big sweep. I thought that was going to be an issue being tall, big legs, um, but actually they are super comfortable and I'll probably keep them on there at least for the first one, first little adventure and then we'll go from there and we'll see. Will we have a shutter position SB Dynamo Hub? I use these on everything. That was one of the reasons I really wanted this bike because it was already built with the Dynamo Hub and just ready to go. On the back we have a Stans rim that was changed um, with a Maxxis Chronicle rear tire. The tires are three inches wide and this is a 29 plus version with some Shimano flat pedals. I might put clips on, I'm not sure yet. So guys, that is just a quick look at my new little whip and I love it, it feels so good just love it if you want to see more adventures on this bike then make sure you subscribe to the channel because we are going away hopefully next week um, for our, we'll give this bike its first test of some off-road touring adventures I, but until next time, keep smiling, enjoy the adventure, peace.